And then you have Amanda, who's an amazing uh, you know, violinist uh, who has a love for Cajun music. Well, I started playing violin when I was four. I'm actually classically trained, but New Orleans has got just all together a very, very unique sound. I guess the music I play, you call it Cajun or um, roots music. And I've been able to take a little bit from everybody that I've met, like Tab and Mr. Chubby. And um, I've really just been able to learn and experience different things. And I think just playing gigs and playing music and just getting together and jamming with different people like that has really formed the sound that I make. Mr. Chubby for a while. He produced my first CD. I don't exactly remember it because I was so little, but um, he always tells everybody that. They call him Chubby because he likes his food. <laughs> and um, he was, we were playing up in Minnesota, and he was on his way to go get his food. Then all of a sudden, he heard this fiddle, and he said, No, nothing ever stops him from getting his food. But for some reason, he had to stop and listen, and um, he saw me, and then we became good friends after that, and he asked if me and my band had a CD out, and we said no, and so he, he said, well, let's go do it, and so you're like, we got to do this project together, and it was really, it was a lot, a lot of fun, and it was a really great first experience. I think music is something that comes from the heart and um, I think it's something you really have to just be able to feel and so um, I want to I wanna always play music as long as I can play music as long as my you know when I'm 80 years old and my old decrepit hands can still hold the fiddle I still want to play music um, because it's fun for me it's just it's fun and I like creating I like performing I like you know recording Whatever happens, I just want to make sure that I live a happy life and that I'm a happy person because that's a true gift.